why women with kids or just one kid is better than women with multiple three or four or five kids. I already done the video on the kid, why women with kids better than so this one for the ones without kids, straight up. Off top, women without kids are usually in better shape than women with kids. Why? Because women without kids has less stress. They don't gotta do a lot of yelling. They don't gotta do a lot of a lot of blood pressure running because they gotta yell. Kids do homework. Gotta work multiple jobs. Gotta this is a lot. Gotta do more cooking and cleaning. Gotta do more watching. Yeah, all that all that affects them with their weight and their health and all that stuff. Uh, a woman without kids can go to the gym more on a consistent basis. She don't really have no distractions. Understand that. She don't gotta go pick the kids up from school and do the day care and all that stuff. She can watch her diet better because she can time her meals. She can do a lot of meal prep. She don't really have to do a lot of fast food. It's really by choice with the woman without kids over the woman with kids. A lot of times the woman with kids, they, she might eat something at McDonald's because she don't feel like going to two or three different places or two places every time. The kids want McDonald's, she want this. Kids want that, but she want this type. The woman with kids don't really gotta do it. She can eat what she wanna eat every day, every day. The woman with with no kids or just one, usually will have a better job. Usually will have a better career. Will make more money than the woman with kids. Why? A lot of women with kids had birth had, had kids at a young age, forced them to leave high school, drop out of high school, or finish school later, or forced them to get low paying jobs. More than a woman who finished school, or maybe went to college, or just had enough time to find the right career and stick with it. And yeah, so usually, like, the woman, she don't really have the distraction. She can really work any shift. The woman with kids, she can work any shift. So she could take the night shift. She could take the whatever shift to pay more or the whatever. Yeah, she could do that. The woman with kids can't. She got to work around her children's schedule, like school and daycare. So even if the the woman with kids made a little bit more, she still got to pay daycare and, all, and pay more money in meals and clothes and shoes. So the woman with no kids can even make less than the woman with kids and still come out on top than a woman with kids. Understand that. So the woman without kids usually, and that what I'm saying is 100%. It's just a lot, most. Um, the woman, the woman with, the woman with no kids can, she has, she has more time available. Yeah, she got, she got more time, more free time, more time available for dates, more time available for spend time with you to get to know you more time available for trips more time available for her own business working on her business uh, uh, more time for school more time for everything where the woman with kids especially two or more got to work around her schedule especially if she don't got the help from the father he not in the house he cannot even if you're not in the house yeah so the one, yeah, the woman, the woman with no kids is gonna be you gonna you gonna be able to spend more time with her unless she's a very very busy woman. And usually with a very very busy woman with single with no kids, she probably really successful. Understand that. The woman with no kids, a lot of them they probably make about forty thousand or more. Usually on drive nicer cars. Usually gonna live in nicer areas. Why? obvious reasons they don't have the extra baggage they can afford a Range Rover or Benz a BMW a top level a Avalon Toyota you know what I'm saying whatever they like they can afford it because they don't really got the kids they can afford the nice apartment so she don't gotta she can afford a one bed she can get a one bedroom to pay about 1400 for one bedroom she can, apartment or something she can get yeah, she live that bitch will be laced out. Good area. But a woman with kids gotta find two, three, four bedroom and she don't make a lot of money or got the support system. She she gotta fit where her income allows her to fit with the most space and a decent school area around.
the woman with no kids and ain't got to worry about all that. Understand that she can just whatever she can just live the life she want to live, based off with her checks and with her other income, whatever she got going, allow her to. Understand that. Women with no kids usually are more attractive in a lot of cases, are more beautiful in a lot of cases. Why? Because the women with children, they they can start off, they may look a certain way in high school or even after high school, but all the kids stretch their body out, stretch their, yeah, they, they get headaches, all that wear and tear on women, especially they doing that and they running the streets hard or they living a fast life or they doing a lot of drugs. You know what I'm saying? That's going to show in their skin. They're going to show in their body. Plus, they eating the wrong foods. A lot of women with kids do more drugs than women without kids because the kids stress them out. The woman with no kids, she ain't really all that. She might just hit the blunt. You might take her on a trip to Cali or just y'all just chilling, Netflix and chill. She might just hit the blunt a couple times. When the woman with kids, if she got a weed habit or whatever habit she got, she'll abuse it more. What if it's the woman with no kids, she probably just drink more, like wine and liquor and shit. She might, you know, all of them like to drink, so. But the other one, the one who getting more stressed, she might got a pill habit, a lean habit. She might do everything you do if you in that type of field, understand that. So the woman with no kids, she can keep herself up more. She can dress better, she can look the woman with kids can look, I mean, the woman with no kids can look better. She can look more pretty for you all the time. You will never see her in her down moments. Like, once you get, after you get comfortable with her, like, when you get comfortable with the woman with kids, you're going to start seeing her with her bonded on. Uh, uh, she can come up with big t-shirts, all the little unattractive shit, bonded big t-shirts, you know, a lot of attitude. You're, you're going to get, when you, yeah, you a lot of yelling. You gonna you gotta especially if you move in with them. She gonna show you that. The woman with kids, she ain't, I mean the woman with no kids, she ain't really gotta. She ain't doing all that. She can keep herself up. She might, you know what I'm saying. She might not put no bonnet on. She might just put a wrap on and still show her hair done. Or she don't even care to mess up her hair because she can go get it done more. She keep herself up more than a woman with kids because she got more time to. Once she get off of work and whatever else she got to do, she done. She can keep her nails up. She got the extra money. It ain't going to three or four different kids. She can keep, yeah, her body massage, her body all, yeah, feeling all soft. Understand that. More than with the woman with kids. The woman with kids got, she don't got a lot of time throughout the day. Work, she's trying to, she's trying to come up and maybe start her own business or find a better career school. You know what I'm saying? All the kids, daddy ain't there. Or you know what I'm saying? Or he in the streets. So tight. So a lot of stress, a lot of bullshit put them through. They be going through more than a woman with no kids. Understand that. Dating a woman with no kids, you don't have to worry about no baby daddy drama. A lot of these females, they fuck with a lot of gangsters. They got two or three baby daddies, all of them gangsters. If you a legit type of guy, you're not in the streets or in the urban lifestyle, or want, want, want to get on demon time or that level, yeah, you gotta deal with her crazy ass baby daddy, but she's claimed it's crazy. Which all they all the baby mamas say their baby daddy's crazy, but I don't think they crazy just because they slain the iron. If you, I they tell me they crazy, I feel like if they ain't chopped nothing up or ain't no if they ain't no cannibal or chop nothing up, they ain't with that, they ain't crazy. They just slain the iron. That's the American way. It, it, what's different between them and the average white boy that can shoot two, three miles down the street, they can't do that. They've been they ain't doing the same shit since they got vented guns. They ain't really, they don't stab nothing to death. They gun shit down. They don't stab shit, chop, chop shit up. They ain't really wicked like that. They just uh, on some gangster shit type. So they assume that's crazy. Because maybe, yeah, maybe they is crazy to them. Because they, if they a crash out for any look, she stepped on my shoe type of shit. So that's shit you got to deal with. Nigga, you got, she got two or three baby daddies and she swear they ain't shit, but she picked the same type of niggas and they all in the streets and now they want to meet you. Now they gonna know where you stay at. She gonna tell them about you sometime. Nigga might not even want you to be around their kids because you really way better than them at every level. So nigga wanna, nigga might send nigga to rob you and play like they ain't nothing. Yeah, because they got homeboys. Nigga pull up and go pick his kid up from your house. 
I mean, yeah, pick his kids up from your house. Nigga got niggas and all in the car from the other side type. You got to deal with that. Dating a girl that dated guys like that. Or she only, they, only got, they can just be crazy ass regular guys. They got jobs and good careers. Understand that, my nigga. You have to go through that with a woman with no kids, you ain't ever, or just one, you really ain't gotta go through all that like that. Understand that. Um, so that's less stress. It could save you a life sentence. It could save you getting killed, getting hurt, losing a lot of blood. Understand that. Losing your careers and stuff. You never know what kind of situation that you, 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 you know what I'm saying? Cause I don't, if she got two or three baby daddies, she might not be out of love with all of them. She might still like one of them, but one of them just won't act right. So she still got feelings for him. She still really wish she could do right. So she'll just take you, cause really you on the right path. Like she, you really what she want him to be, but he retarded and she really kind of grew out of it. But that don't mean she still won't give him, yeah. She still won't slide, let him, yeah, get behind that thing, yeah. And then the, the entanglement shit start to happen. Understand that you with the woman with one kid or she, usually the girl with one kid, she didn't really got over him. Especially if it been a long time. Or the, the one with no kids, you ain't even got to deal with it type. Understand that. The woman with uh, no kids, you usually can save more money dating them. Understand that. Like, you don't, it's, the woman with kids, you got to buy more food, more clothes, bigger cars, bigger houses. The woman with no kids, you really ain't, unless she, she really took designer and all that, but if she really ain't getting she really don't got a good job. Like she really, it's only so much designer she can ask for. She really ain't. You only making twenty, thirty. You know what I'm saying? Thirty-five for thousand. You can't really ask for ten thousand dollar person. You can't even afford it. So it's only so much. So, but the uh, unless she already high maintenance, she already buying that shit herself. So then now you got to kind of keep up because she really can do it this shit herself, pretty much. So she really ain't gonna accept if she in that type of lifestyle. She gonna expect more gifts that way. But if you ain't really, if that really ain't the downfall of that, and, and you barely making it, you got your bag right, you'll save more money. You only buying something for you and her. If you got a kid and that too. But if you the man, you probably don't got full custody. So nine times ten, you yeah, you just paying for two. Understand that. So you'll save more money with women with no kids unless they got a high, unless they high maintenance. And they could be high maintenance. They didn't work hard. They didn't build themselves to a certain status. Understand that. They deserve that. They make nice things. They make expensive cars, expensive clothes, expensive everything, restaurants, and expensive places to live for people who don't give up on their dream. People who work hard. Even if they do it on the dumb way, you still got to work hard, do something right to even acquire these things and still maintain your bills type. Understand that. A woman with no kids is easy to relocate for business. Yeah, the one with no kids, I can easily be like, yeah, we need to move to Texas. Cause look, you you this, I'm a truck driver, you maybe you a dispatcher, you or you something in that kind of field. Hey, or you, a rapper made the rap scene better in Atlanta, we need to move Atlanta, they can just pack this shit up and go. Especially if they're playing right and you already get money or type, they they'll pack it up and go. There ain't no question to act, fuck it, leave all this shit there. Just let's go, type. They can easily they can easily fly out to certain places. When you're you might be say you're a truck driver, you on the road. I mean, you do it like you take a home time in Cali. She can fly out to see you, especially if she make decent money. She can fly. Out, she could just drop everything, just fly, come see you. With the woman with kids, you gotta you might have to pay for babysitters because you want her to come see you, right? Unless she got a good family support. A lot of these women, especially from the urban area. That we don't have a lot of strong family support. Grandma could be already gone. Mama could be already gone. So they don't really got sister want to live her life. They already don't got the family support. So you got to pay for babysitters. Money can make people change their mind. So you got to pay for that. Or she got to, you know what I'm saying? So they can kind of like drop what they're doing. If they really rock with you. They interest level so high enough, they'll do that. Over the faster than a woman with kids. Understand that. The woman with kids. I mean, a woman with um, no kids is easy to build with for business, to get richer. You'll probably get richer with the woman without no kids than the woman with kids. Understand that. Why? You're, it's already a bigger build with the kids. You got to have a big enough, it got to be a big, big plan. 
it, you got to make sure where you got more room to make mistakes with a woman with no kids because y'all don't have a high bill. Y'all don't have y'all don't have a lot of high risk, a lot of high overhead. A woman with no kids, say if you was, she run the truck, y'all can just jump in the truck and team and run a bag up, make a million dollars in a couple of years, three years. Y'all done ran up at five hundred, six hundred thousand. I ain't gonna say a million. I'm gonna say, you know, what I'm saying three, four hundred thousand, easy. About three years type. Y'all can run a bag up. The women with kids can't, so it's easy to build with the women without no kids. Y'all can just like it's just easy all the way around the board type. It don't matter even if she got the help system. She if people still get tired, still gotta act, still gotta you ain't really gotta do none of that. Understand that with the woman with no kid. So like I said, like uh, they got they they got they you know the women with kids got their cons. With the woman with, with no kid, I mean the woman with no kid, they got their cons. Like what you got to worry about with them is how they gonna be with a mother, how they gonna be motherhood, how they gonna be, how can, if they can cook or not. Is they really a freak like that? Is they sex game really? Yeah. Uh, the woman with no kids, she can let that independent shit. I mean, a woman with no kids, she can let that independent shit get to her head. And she can be more uh, uh, in a competition with you. So they got they, you know what I'm saying? So you just got to figure out which one better for you. Which one you cool with. Understand that, man. Come.